everybody, this is Nisel and welcome to Soul and Garden. Today I will be showing you two of my favorite flowers that are in bloom. They are the marigolds and the beehive ginger. Come on! These are my marigolds and it's their first time to bloom um, since I planted them for about three months ago. I have watered this with rice wash and fish meal and it is still very healthy though um, it, it is planted on the, in the same pot with uh, aglaonima and spider plants but it grew tall here and I guess it's the same height as me I also spray this marigold with FFJ or fermented fruit juice. I planted the other marigolds here in my vegetable garden along with this flower and I forgot its name. And as we can see this flower has also a bud and it's about to bloom maybe days from now. I planted this marigold here because they say they say that it's good um, to be in the garden to keep the bad um, bad insects or the pests away. And so they are now start um, starting to bloom. And here, this one uh, is about to bloom. It hasn't opened its flower yet. This one. Uh, no, it's not so short, but it's just its stem was bent towards the ground, that's why it appears shorter. But if it just stands straight, it is as tall as the others. And this one is my um, favorite because uh, this is only one plant, but it has so many, many blooms and it's also very tall like the others because i don't i didn't put any uh, synthetic fertilizer in these plants um what i water them is uh, rice wash and fish meal and i also could, um regularly put compost in them and also uh, cow manure tea and they are planted together with my okra here in this vegetable garden now let's take a look at my beehive ginger these plants are very seasonal uh, here are their blooms it is green with scattered um, white white shoots or little flowers white little flowers like that and these plants uh, die die off during the hot season and they start to grow again um, after the rain has come and this is not the final bloom i mean the final color because as the months will go by this green color will turn into red and that is the uh, what we consider the mature flower when it turns red and maybe it will take one or two months for these blooms to turn into red here at the back are some flowers and there are also other flowers over there that's all for today see you again in the next video